Luke Doherty, who's in the studio. Good to see you this morning. I mean, these sort of criticisms, if you like, of the mindfulness mm-hmm. being done in schools, can you appreciate where, the, where it's coming from? Yeah, I, can, I, I sort of resonate with it on one level because my, uh, my journey has been about how do you make mindfulness accessible. You know, when I was 15, if I'd been told to sit still and meditate, I think I'd probably jumped out the jumped out the room mm. so it's how do you make how do you make it accessible and what we've done is mix it with boxing and developed a, mox, a boxing mindfulness program now that seems on the face of it an odd juxtaposition yeah, yeah, boxing yeah. and mindfulness how yeah. does that work well basically we start with a, a meditation to kind of calm people down and then we express energy through boxing and when you when you do that kind of sort of crude physical exercise you have an endorphin rush you feel good and then meditation makes more sense because you're connected to your body you've got that nice feeling and you can sort of learn to switch off. And I think young people are really responding to this because it's, it's dynamic. It's got a different image around it as well because mindfulness can seem a little bit weak or a little bit fluffy. So we're trying to create a dynamic image. Well, well there's a question for you then that I'm sure loads of people at home are, are wondering. What actually is mindfulness? Um, well, I work with a lot of people and they say, oh, I can't do mindfulness, I can't do mindfulness. But any time you've got absorbed in something, like reading a book, in this conversation now, you're not thinking about other things, you're here, you're present. That is my, mindfulness is trying to help you get into that state. So it's a technique to help you develop that more kind of absorbed, enjoyable state of mind. And, um, but is, yeah. it, is it a bit like meditation? Because whenever I've tried meditation, I sit there thinking of all the things I could be doing. Yeah, well, <laughs> it, meditation is, is, is a way to really help you become more present and develop that, that state of mind. Mindfulness is a broader term which can involve, you know, we're being mindful now. You know, mm. so meditation is a are you, mind, are you Are you practising mindfulness if you're just pottering in the garden? Um, yeah, you can be. If you're aware of what you're doing, you're aware of how you feel. Again, it's that. I work also with athletes to get into this flow state, which is about when you're absorbed, you're kind of not thinking, you're, you're performing at your best. That is, you know, that, again, that's a mindful state. You're kind of, you're absorbed. You're not like, you know, that sometimes when you go to bed, you're trying to switch off and your mind's going yes, round. Yeah. We're trying to move away from that and live in a more kind of flow state. So athletes are using this as well. That's another reason why, we, you know, working with athletes such as Marcus Smith, it helps young people get a different image around it. It's something that can help you perform better. It's more dynamic, it's sporty. So I think mindfulness needs a whole rebranding to make young people find it less boring in a way. But if it's- I mean, what, is, it, is it, I mean, the, from what you seem to be saying, it's about being in the, in the now, appreciating what you're doing yeah. Just right now, not not thinking to what, not thinking past or, or future. Just just yeah. right now. Well, Harvard did a study fairly recently saying something like forty six um, percent of the time we're not present here now. We're thinking what we're having for lunch, mm. an argument I've had with my partner, whatever. We're not here. So mindfulness is trying to say you can develop more of that, and it's nice when you're present, you're here, you're not thinking about worrying about things. It's so it's, it's an enjoyable state of mind that you can start to develop when, you, when, you, when you're in the now, when you're present. So I-